ஹலோ கைஸ் அண்ட் வெல்கம் டு பைத்தன் ப்ரோக்ராமிங் டுட்டோரியல்ஸ் பை அமுல்ஸ் அகாடமி டுடே இன் திஸ் டுட்டோரியல் வி ஆர் டிஸ்கஸிங் அபவுட் அ பைத்தன் ப்ரோக்ராம் தட் இஸ் ஹவு வி கேன் ஸ்வாப் டூ நம்பர்ஸ் வித் அவர் விதவுட் யூஸிங் தி தேர்ட் வேரியேபிள் ஓகே ஸோ தட் இஸ் நத்திங் பட் இன் ஆர் ப்ரோக்ராம் வில் டேக் தி இன்புட் ஃபார் எக்ஸாம்பிள் இஃப் ஐ டேக் மை வேரியேபிள் நேம் ஆஸ் ஏ அண்ட் இஃப் ஐ டேக் தி வேல்யூ ஆஸ் டென் தென் ஐ இல் டேக் அனதர் வேரியேபிள் கால் பி and i'll take value as 5 now in my program i want the output like this i want a value to be 5 and b value to be 10 i want to swap these two numbers okay we can do this by two methods one is using the third variable and the second way is without using the third variable in that we'll add and subtract the value and we'll swap the numbers okay so we will see the first method that is using third variable how to swap this numbers okay so in the first method what we will do is first we will take the input so if a value is 10 and b value is 5 okay this is our input next what i'll do is i'll take the third variable as temp okay first i'll assign a value to this so now both temp and a value is 10 here now temp value is 10 a value is 10 okay okay so in the next line what i'll do is here i'll take a equal to b that is nothing but i'll assign the value of b to a so here uh, b value is 5 so here now a value and b value become 5 okay after this i'll write b is equal to temp so here temp value is 10 right we stored the a value in temp so temp value is 10 so here temp value is 10 so b value becomes 10 so here in the output we'll get a value as 5 and b value as 10 so we'll get output as a is equal to 5 and b is equal to 10 here we can see numbers are swapped so this is the one way so now we'll write the program so here in the python file first we need to take the input that is we'll ask the user to enter the numbers okay so i'll take my variable name as a i'll use input function to take input from the user so i'll write a message here enter the value for a okay here we know in the python 3 this input function will take input as the string value by default it will treat this input as the string value so here if i enter the value as 10 now it will treat that as the string value and it will store that string value in this variable but here i don't want that i want integer input so here i need to convert this so here i'll use int function okay next i'll take my variable name as b so here also i'll use input function and i'll write the message enter the value for b here also i need to convert this input to int because we need integer input okay and now we'll do the swapping process for that we need to write temp is equal to a so now the value of a will be assigned to temp okay next here i'll take a is equal to b now the value of b will be stored in a and here i write b is equal to temp so here in the variable temp value of a will be stored so that will be assigned to b now the value of a and b are swapped so now we need to print that so print after swapping print so now i'll print value of a comma a print comma b okay so after swapping we'll print the result okay now we are done with the code so we need to save this and run this 
so now here we can see the message enter the value for a so now i'll enter the value for a as 10 and the enter the value for b i'll enter as 5 so after the swapping we can see value of a is 5 and value of b is 10 okay the values are swapped okay so we wrote the python program based on the first method that is swapping two numbers using third variable now the second way is swapping two numbers without using third variable okay so for this we need to add and subtract the value and we'll get the desired output okay so for this what i'll do is first this is the input a is equal to 10 b is equal to 5 okay first i'll add a plus b and i'll store that result in the variable a okay so here a plus b that is 10 plus 5 so here now after this okay a value becomes 15 okay next in the line i'll write b is equal to a minus b so here we can see a value is 15 so here it will become 15 and b value is 5 right so 5 so here b value becomes 10 right 15 minus 5 is 10 so we'll get b value as 10 okay now to get the value of a i'll write a is equal to a minus b here a value is 15 because here we can see right so here a value become 15 b value is 10 okay in the previous line we got b value that is 10 so 15 minus 10 so a value become 5 okay so we'll get the output as a5 and b equal to 10 which is the desired output here we can say after swapping number we want a equal to 5 and b equal to 10 right so we got the output so to swap two numbers without using the third variable first we need to add that two variable that is a plus b so we'll get this sum and we'll store that in the variable a after that from that sum if we subtract the value of b then we'll get new value of b the value of b after swapping okay next again if we subtract the newly found b value from a that is the total sum we'll get the a value okay okay so so first we need to take two inputs a and b next here I write a is equal to a plus b first we need to add that two numbers then to get the new value for b we need to subtract value b from a so we'll get the b value after swapping next to get a i need to do the same thing that is a minus b so rest all is same so we need to save this and run this so enter the value for a i'll enter 10 here i'll enter 5 so here we can see 5 and 10 so if i enter value of a is minus 10 b as 6 then here we can see value of a is 6 b is minus 10 okay so this is about the swapping two numbers with and without using the third variable so that's it for now thank you for watching don't forget to subscribe to my channel I'll meet you in next class. Till then, take care.